With the growth of inverter-based resources and the increase in variable loads on the grid, you need comprehensive approaches to identify and address complex situations. GE Vernova's Plan OS platform provides a holistic approach to planning for your energy system's most pressing challenges. Plan OS works across a single platform to handle integrated system planning. With Plan OS, GE Vernova's modular planning software applications now are integrated into a single platform, breaking down traditional planning silos. Instead of building and configuring individual labor-intensive datasets, you can use a unified dataset model on a single platform to seamlessly run different simulations through all modules. In addition, multiple groups running different modules can work separately within the same platform and still easily merge and use the outputs in the next step of the process. Let's see how you can use this comprehensive software platform to confidently plan for a reliable, resilient, and stable energy system. In the transmission planning stage of the analysis, Steady State Power Flow tells you if your transmission system works. Start here by running a dataset through Steady State Power Flow. Steady State Power Flow sends network topology data to the transfer analysis, contingency analysis, and dynamic power flow modules. Transfer analysis takes the new data and looks for differences in limitations between zones or utilities, or even between projects. Contingency analysis looks at the lines to determine potential issues on the network and which line should be monitored in the analysis. Dynamic power flow looks at second-to-second -second operation of the grid simulations, useful for evaluating interconnections to determine if a project can comply with grid code requirements. Together, these four modules simulate the physical behavior of the grid and connected equipment under stable operating conditions, identifying potential vulnerabilities and helping ensure reliable operation. Plan OS also helps with economic planning. Base data from steady state power flow and contingency definitions from contingency analysis flow into the nodal production cost module, resulting in a techno-economic analysis and the transfer analysis module sends operating limits for a specific module to the zonal production cost module to simulate the economic operation of the power system. Given the limitations of your transmission system, you can identify the most economical way to schedule generation to serve demand. Transfer analysis can also feed dynamic emergency limits data to the resource adequacy module. Based on your units and how much you depend on your neighbors, See how reliable your system is. Other commercial programs require you to license separate tools to calculate changes in limit. With Plan OS, you can quickly rerun your analysis and get new emergency limits to feed into the resource adequacy module. Resource adequacy assesses your reliability of supply to serve customers. Know whether you have built enough generation, storage, and transmission to provide electricity reliably when it is demanded. Understand how much additional capacity you need to keep your system reliable during peak load. Together, the resource adequacy and transfer analysis modules feed data into the new capacity expansion module. Capacity expansion helps you develop a plan for building new generation. Your current generation capacity, placed alongside estimates of future costs, demand, and regulations, gives you a forecast of the most reliable capacity additions and adaptable plans that reduce costs across many possible future outcomes. Optionally, capacity can be fed back into the resource adequacy module to verify if it is a reliable plan. Resource adequacy and capacity expansion also feed into the two production cost modules to simulate the techno-economic details of the grid. Traditional transmission planning analyses do not factor in economics, so you may not get the most realistic result. With integrated system planning, the two production cost modules loop back into steady state power flow in what we call a round trip analysis. These two modules give steady state power flow an economic solution to evaluate in addition to the physical network data, resulting in a richer, more accurate model. With Plan OS, experience end-to-end -end grid planning with a unified dataset and a native, simplified infrastructure using the capabilities of the Plan OS modules.
Integrate your grid planning like never before 